just see the ball reversal, very careful ball reversal, trying to break down that backside defense. That freshman's got a bright future. Absolutely. She can take it off the bounce. She can stop and pop the mid-range, which is a lost art, but she can take it to the rack. By the way, Jackett's three-point defense is third in the ACC, and that's going to be a steal, fast break. Harris, Schwartz is able to get down there and smack it out of bounds. This, the wheels by Schwartz to get there, and boom, all ball. Harris slides out of bounds. Wow. The game off with the possession here in this second half. And then quickly, Strickland pulls the trigger. He's going to bounce and drop in. 2.5 seconds. Got to get it in. They do. Lewis, three. Yes, it's in! Pittsburgh ties the game 71-71. Here is the replay. 71-71 of the three-point shot. That is good, and Pittsburgh has tied this game. <laughs> we will have an extra... <laughs> She's got all four points here in the OT period for the Jackets. Harris uses the screen, puts it up. Yeah, drains it. 75-75, under a minute to play. A scoop and a score is exactly what Pitt wants. All right, Hayford. Here is Strickland. She touches it. She's got to put up a long three. Not going to get there, and we will go to a second OT. Dunn back to Schwartz. Now they go inside. Now back, side, back out to Dunn. She goes baseline and a beautiful move by Dunn. And this is a chance to see who's going to go the distance in double overtime. Harris left all alone, and she has an easy basket on the finger roll. Inbound, Harris is going to take it. And, oh, the offensive board going to be put back by King. Schwartz has got to put it up. She does, and that's off the mark. Pitt will have it, and that's the ball game. It took over uh, two overtimes to do it, but the Pittsburgh Panthers come on the road and defeat Georgia Tech 85-79.